Hey SP3 team. So today I'm going to talk to you about 33, SP333. It's a three year ceramic coating. It's going to give you a glossy, hydrophobic, somewhat scratch resistant and chemical resistant coating that's going to form a permanent bond with the paint or your client's paint. And we like this because it's a three year coating. It's, we find that a lot of people are kind of torn between our two year offering and our five year offering. Um, the most, most people only keep their cars for three to four years. That's the average. The average age of a vehicle on the road is 11 or 12 years, but most single owners only keep their car for that three or four year time frame. So this is a great coating for that person. So it's really easy to use. I'm going to show you how to use it. We always use auto fiber saver applicators, as you know, here, and we level with auto fiber quadrant wipes. Um, so 33, real simple. We're going to apply it to, uh, we're going to clean the surface. In this case, we polished, we compound and polished the surface. And then we use SB3 Ready to wipe it down. And the SB3 Ready is a critical step to make sure that the paint is ready to accept the ceramic coating. Now, you don't have to do a paint correction. That's not, that's fake. That's not real. You don't have to do that every time, but you do need to do a panel wipe. SB3 Ready is your choice there. So. Just like other coatings, like I showed you in Vortex and other things, if it's not a new bottle, I use one side of the coating applicator just to dust off the top. Now this is a pretty new bottle, so it doesn't have the crystallized stuff formed. Eventually that stuff builds up. So I use this to kind of clean that off from the last application. And then I flip it over and I use the other side so it doesn't get the crystal scratching the paint. And you know, you can probably put uh, one, two, three, four, there's maybe like 10-ish, 12-ish drops. And I'm gonna show you, it is gonna coat this whole hood with just this and this applicator. So I kind of start in the middle of a panel just in case so that the concentration is in the middle and can be spread around. Now you may have heard that you can't go back and forth with this, that's not true. You can go back and forth. It's not gonna wipe it off if you go backwards like this. Um, you just need to make sure you got good coverage and that's the only thing that matters really and because of ceramic coating it just a little bit is all you need it doesn't have to be laid on heavy so to speak and the sp333 is a one layer coating and typically we like to wait two minutes for a flash time sp3 does rainbow you're probably not gonna be able to see it on camera but it does rainbow so you can look for that and adjust the flash time as necessary for your shop and your conditions. If it's more humid or it's hot or you're mobile even, uh, it's gonna flash faster. So you may only be able to do half a panel even with SB3 coatings. So then I got my quadrant wipe. I can see a rainbow on my end, uh, but we're gonna give it a little bit longer, a couple, uh, another minute or so, and then we're gonna wipe. All right, so I see the rainbow, so I'm gonna wipe. I love how this comes off. It's so easy to get off. A lot of, a lot of coatings you're from uh, other companies or whatever, if you've tried in the past, you may find yourself looking at it from really odd angles, just trying to make sure that you don't have residue. But with SB3, the one thing I love about all their coatings, not just 33, is that it's so easy to wipe off and it's really forgiving. If you miss a spot, sometimes you have quite a while, as long as you're not in a really bad condition area. All right, guys, 33, three years of protection. Just make sure you at least use SB3 Ready or a solvent-based panel prep. You don't have to do correction, but you can do correction. You get that hydrophobic properties, gloss, chemical resistance, some minor scratch resistance, easier to clean, self-cleaning, SV333.